now. Hold this end up here. Hot, it's hot. I told you it's hot. hot. No, you scared me. I scared you. Ready? You need a little pee pee? Put it over there. Don't step on my cord. But that's $300 for that fucking thing. See? Piece situation, am I right, Steve? Yep. Now, what are we going to do with this, dude? This. Yes. It's welded on here. Which is this slide. Right here. Okay, now, do you want to round these corners off? Uh, yeah, that would be a good idea. Put it back up there, please. Okay. Now, once we get all this well, Steve's gonna have to come back with this with the grinder and round all that off. It's gonna look really nice. What the hell, dude? That's not flexible enough? No. Perfect. Perfect. It's hot. Hot? Twice. <laughs> now what I wanna do is we're gonna do this upside down. Okay. Let me figure First out. thing we need to do is we need to find the very center of this, bud. Okay. So where did my little marker go? Right here. So we got 12 in the center, just like that. Now we got six going this way, see? Piece of tape. Now, what you're looking at here is I always use my tape for a straight line on something like this. That's the best way to do it. While I'm doing this, maybe Steve can go ahead and plug the welder in for us. So what I did is I found my center and I'm going to go like that. So that's our center line right there. I'm going to use this edge. And then this is our center line right here, see? Does that make sense? So then Steve's going to take these and he's going to go ahead and tape them on here just like we did those other ones, bud. Can you do that, Steve? Get them where they're pretty even. Now what Steve's doing is taping those on there. Duh, that's good, bud. And what that's gonna do, that's gonna hold it in there for us. Make sure it looks level, dude. And then we're gonna set those on our center line here, and then we'll eyeball the center of this. Because this doesn't have to be exactly 100% perfect, am I right? No, it does not. Okay, now, let me get my welding helmet on. Mario, I need you to come over here with the camera now. Yes, Steve. This is the center. That's the center line. So then, we're going to come over here, and Steve's going to hold that on there and eyeball the center of that, and he's going to take the back end of that angle and line it up with that line, bud. See there? See what I'm saying? Okay. Can you hold that so I can weld it, sir? Yeah. Look. Gotta come over here where I'm at. Look, the tape will stop it, bud. The tape will stop it. Okay. And then hold that angle just like you want it. And then I'm gonna weld it on and get it lined up in there how you want. It, okay? Okay. okay. <laughs> Jesus. Okay, are we ready? Not yet. Are you oh, ready, man. sir? What the fuck, this man? We got everybody has a fuck. See how it is over here, dude? He can still do his business and tell me, shut the fuck up. <laughs> but I can't go do what I need to do. Yeah. Okay, thanks, bud. Sorry. Steve's actually uh, ditching work today. Right, Steve? Yeah. Look, this one here looks a little longer. But it really doesn't matter, it'll still go on the same. Okay, get it where you want it. Let me see. That looks about even right there. Can you bring it down your way here more? Right there. Okay, now. 
Hold it right there. There we go, bud. Are you ready? You ready? Yeah. Get this tape off. Now, what I want you to do, dude, let go of that thing. What I need you to do is listen to me. This is important. Okay? These little welds here are nice, but this is very thin tubing, okay? What we need to do is you need to measure between here, okay? Because we need to put a piece between here so we can weld that to this plate. The small or big? The small stuff. Okay. All right? Can you go ahead and do that while I'm finished welding this? What do you got there? That's uh, six and an eighth. Okay, six and an eighth inches. Go ahead and cut one out, and I'm going to weld that to there. And what that's going to do is that's going to give us a brace, man. What are you doing, Steve? Nothing cutting. Come on, man, we're on a time schedule here, buddy. Make it just a hair smaller. Let's see what we did here, dude. Fuck. Mother! You make it fucking the right size. Six and an eighth, dude. You made a five and seven eighths or some shit. Give me that fucking stuff. Let me have it, bud. There you go, see, now you're thinking, Jesus. It's just a hair smaller. God, dude. Wasting my fucking material. You're supposed to follow it, Mario. Give me it. I need to grind it myself, dude, because there's a weld there. That was an afterthought when I started welding. It's still too fucking big. Oh my gosh, bud. See what I gotta do there? I gotta cut this corner out. Come here. See what I'm doing here, I grinded that corner out to go around that well, dude, because that was kind of an afterthought thing, right. see? I want to put this on here. Let's grind some more out. Hang on. Yeah. See, all that is is a brace, dude. It's going to help hold your fucking deal up. Does that make sense, Steve? I'm trying to teach you all something here. Makes sense. You see what I'm saying? Look how much stronger it made that. Hold down on it. Take the tape off. All right, basically what we did, we just made ourselves a trailer queen. Show them all. Garage queen special size. So see now Steve doesn't even have to open his doors, touch his car. Nothing. And if Steve had the money and he could afford it, he'd buy himself a trailer to put his car on and paint it the same color as your car, wouldn't you, bud? No. I didn't know where to store the trailer. Okay, so <laughs> what we got to do, we go like this. This is a nice three step deal if Mario can watch. We slide these legs on here. Steve's going to get to the car show after he sets up his chair, of course. Gets himself a nice cozy going. And then you take this, you slide it in here. Why doesn't that fit? Probably okay, well that's even better because it'll fit tight. And it's gonna slide on there just like that. And voila, show trailer special. There you go. What do you think, bud? I gotta dig the shit out. Okay. We rounded our corners off right here, made them nice and safe and secure. Safety is always first. Safety is always first. Number one. Uh, number one. We got our corners rounded off here. Steve's going to go ahead and grind all that down and uh, probably, hopefully, maybe have it ready for painting. I don't know. Is it? Is it ready for painting? Okay. It needs to be clean. Once the tire holds it down, it'll be great. It'll be work. It's great. It's a great item. Is that what you want? Exactly. Okay. What else? Did you want to put a piece of metal in there still? In the opening there. There you go. This is Pete. Steve and his pulpit. What is that called? A pulpit? If you were gonna it's the preach, pulpit. If you were going to preach the cars. Volkswagen Steve and his trailer show queen pulpit. All action in here. That took approximately... What are you doing, bud? Okay, you don't like the way that fits? Let me see it. No, it's fine. Well, we might have to take it. 
three pieces. Yeah, but if we take the hammer, we can easily store it. Well, That's right. If you take a hammer, you can knock that over and it'll store it. In store it in your trunk. Or? Store it in your car, put it in your trunk. Hell, put it in your trailer with your queen, bud. I don't know what the fuck you want to do this, but do it. Okay. There you go. This is Pete. Steve and his pulpit. What is that called? A pulpit? If you were gonna it's the preach, pulpit. If you were going to preach yeah. the car. Volkswagen Steve and his trailer show queen pulpit. All action in here. That took approximately... What are you doing, bud? Okay, you don't like the way that fits in the sift. No, it's fine. Well, we might have to Three pieces. Yeah, but if we take the hammer, we can... Easily store it. That's right. If you take a hammer, you can knock that over and it'll store it. In it. Store it in your trunk. Or... Store it in your car. Put it in your trunk. Hell, put it in your trailer with your queen, bud. I don't know what the fuck you want to do this, but do it. Here's a hammer. Okay. Now Steve needs a hammer. I got to go. This is Pete. We got Volkswagen Steve over here uh, screwing me up in the fucking ass as usual. Giving it to me for free. Using my fucking... Look at what he's doing here, bud. Wow. Using my motherfucking rubber mallet on a piece wow. of metal. <laughs> You're lucky that's a snap-on, dude. You're lucky. There you go. Look at that. Okay. One, two, three. We're done with the car show. Setting up. Roll the car over. Snap it in. I think Steve is happy. Fuck yeah, he's happy for free. <laughs> Why not? Where's your brother at on this one? Where's he at? Because, bud, you guys are the Freebie Brothers. Okay. It's not the Giant Brothers, it's the Freebie Brothers. All the Freebie aside, these are available at Southwest to Rod and Customs for 295 bucks. Yeah! We'll do the Wow! Other. $295. Did you hear the salesman? Gee! 295 bucks. We painted the same color as your car. It's executed. And we'll, and we'll do the artwork for you to uh, frame it here. It comes with a piece of plexiglass. So Everything's ready to go. We're going to paint it too, huh? Wow! Yeah, we gotta go, man. I'll see you later, buddy. Take it easy. Take it easy.